What's up guys, Buckland here to bring you some quality content. Today we're going to be playing a game called Garten of Ban Ban. So if you would please sit down, strap in, keep all hands and feet inside the gaming area, and Buckland for the ride. What's up guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Bucklin, here to bring you some quality content. What's up guys, Bucklin here to bring you another video. What's up guys, my name is Bucklin. What's up guys, my name is Bucklin. What's up guys, my name is Bucklin. Let's go ahead and buckle in for the ride. So without further ado, everyone, why don't you just uh, go ahead and buckle in for the ride. Let's buckle in for the ride. I don't like mug. Don't like it. I don't like mug at all. I'm such a pussy when it comes to horror games, bro. I don't know why I play them. Up is where uppers go. I am an upper. I am now currently an upper. I remember one time I got this huge Lego set and it was like 3,600 pieces and I thought that was insane. I thought that was awesome. It was like. Without any further ado, let's buckle in for the ride. Without further ado, let's buckle in for the ride. Let's buckle in for the ride. So without further ado, please keep your hands and feet inside your viewing area at all times and buckle in for the ride. What is up, guys? It's your boy, Bucklin, bringing it back to you. One year. Holy shit. Went by just like that. I, uh, I can't believe that we've made it here, and I'm so thankful and grateful for being here. And thank you for watching this video. I greatly appreciate it. <clears throat> All right, first and foremost, uh, I'm going to address the elephant in the room. That was a pretty sad intro. <laughs> pretty cringy if you ask me uh i do apologize but i kind of wanted to get the feel of like accomplishment and like fulfillment and hopefully i achieve that if not oh well today is gonna be kind of like a recap video on how i've progressed hopefully throughout the year and uh if you guys don't see any progression then i'm doing something wrong but i really think that i'm doing something great so why don't we go ahead and buckle in for the ride? All right, so I had a kind of an idea for this uh, for this video, where I would go through like my favorite games, my least favorite games, and really uh, tell you why. Um, so we're gonna do that really quick. I'm gonna kind of speed through it a little bit. So my favorite games of the past one year were definitely uh, Colot. I really enjoyed Colot. Um, I didn't get a lot of views on it, which is fine, uh, but I really enjoyed fucking fuck out of that game the reason why i liked it so much was because uh um you were kind of forced to explore out of your comfort zone you were forced to read a map which i think is really fucking cool not a lot of games have that kind of mechanic and i'm really happy that uh they decided to go that route another reason is because it was pretty scary um especially when you get into the fog area and the monster chase scene that can get fucking terrifying my second favorite game of the year was Anyone There. Now, Anyone There was really, really cool because it was a randomly generated map every single time. Uh, that is really cool. There's no same gameplay ever. I thought the monster design was really cool. I thought the sound design was really cool. I liked the mechanic of the game. We have to go around each classroom, find clues, and then 
pretty much put this demon back to where it came from. Another game I really enjoyed was Titan Chaser. Uh, I really like the exploration of that game. I thought it was really fun. It wasn't a horror game, which is refreshing, but it was an adventure game, and it did kind of uh, give some kind of thrill to the video, which was really nice. And the last game I want to uh, give credit to is, of course, Modern Warfare 3. It's not like the greatest game in the world, but you can't deny it's not fun. It's a fun game to play with the boys. It's a fun game to just fuck around on. It might be one of my favorite games uh, so far. So those are my uh, those are my favorite games of the past year. And uh, I'm going to go through my least favorite games. First and foremost is Egghead Gumpty. What the fuck is that game? I did not enjoy that game in the slightest. I played it because it looked interesting, and I tried to make a video out of it, and it was frustrating. I couldn't figure out the mechanic. I didn't like the concept. It was just, overall, I did not like it. The second game was, what is snowman made of? It's literally you just making snowmen. That could be fun, but it wasn't for me. And the last one was Parasomnia, uh, mainly because I didn't get to win. Uh, I didn't get to enjoy it the proper way because my PC could not run it properly, but that's not the reason really why I didn't like it. I didn't like it because it made me feel very motion sick. That's the real reason why I didn't enjoy it as much as I should have. Maybe if I give it another try, I would see differently, but uh, at the moment, that's not my priority. What is my priority is uh, getting to these games I want to play this year. There are a ton of games that I would like to, uh, to get my hands on and to play, and I'm really excited to let you know that I'm moving to some big name games. It's not going to be a bunch of random uh, free game here, free game there, indie horror game, whatever. It's going to be a lot of bigger long term games. First on my list is I am going to attempt to play all of the Outlast games. We're going to see uh, how that goes. Secondly, on my games to play list is the Resident Evil, specifically six and seven. The reason for that is because I don't like the way that uh, one through five, I believe, looks and plays. I've tried to play them before. I did not enjoy it. So uh, I'm going to skip those. If you don't like that, I'm very sorry. If I'm missing some lore, I do apologize. But I want to play games I will enjoy. I'm probably going to have to have a little bit of help with this one, which is Minecraft. Uh, I really want to start <laughs> doing that. <laughs> That'd be really fun. And then, of course, uh, we have Enshrouded that just came out on Wednesday. I'm going to be playing that a little bit. And uh, Once Human, which is coming out later on in the year. And obviously, as more games come out, the more I'm going to play. So you will have that to look forward to. And uh, yeah, and that's kind of all the things I wanted to say. That's all the uh, information I have to give you at the moment. But uh, yeah, if anything changes, I'll let you know. I am planning on starting the Outlast series uh, next. So you can expect the first video to come out pretty soon, hopefully. I do have a video coming out tomorrow, which is uh, part two of Blood Pressure with my friends Justin and Marshall. So make sure you check that out. And make sure to check out the TikTok and Instagram as well. You can find clips and such. Uh, it'll be in the description below. So I think that's it for this video. I think we're good. So uh, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like. Make sure to subscribe if you want to see more of me. Hit that bell button and my microphone so you always know when I post. And until next time, I'll see you all later.